hi there to my friends and those who are watching that I don't know because I have realized I have been having more viewers than followers so I'm not sure if it's only my friend watching but I am my friends watching but I'm going to do a brief introduction of myself because I haven't done so and just by the title just one productive not many people know me uh, YouTube and wherever they're watching me from so who am I do I even know who I am let's see <laughs> okay um, my nickname is Bonnie because uh, my real name is Bojana Prdanovic but my nickname is Bonnie because I worked at school in after school care with kids in Perth and Western Australia where I live and the kids couldn't pronounce my name and they gave me a nickname Brie so I said I don't like being a Brie it's too harsh you know what I mean and then they said what about Bonnie I said, okay, bunny sounds good. Let me pretend to be a bunny for a day. <laughs> and they did, and I went to all the other centers, and they called me bunny. Bunny, bunny, bunny. And um, the only people who don't call me bunny is my mother and my best friend, Jody, because they've known me as a Boyana forever, and I'm still Boyana to them. So whatever. I gotta accept that this is my real name. I can't really change it unless I legally change it, but I have no reason to do that. I only give myself name Bonnie for the fun of it, really, and to make it easier for the kids to pronounce. And when I came home, hmm, my mum wasn't very happy because she gave me the name Boyana and she said, You don't like being Boyana, do you? I said, No, really? <laughs> and she said, why don't you teach the kids at school how to say Boyana? Australia is a multicultural country. You should teach them diversity and where you come from and what the name Boyana means. Oh God. So I just started adjusting to being Bonnie. And here I have an offended mum who wants me to teach diversity at schools, <laughs> which is not a bad idea after all. Australia is a multicultural country and there is a lot of kids from everywhere in after school care where I worked and in classrooms and la la la. So I they asked me a bit about Boyana, Boyana, Boyana. That is the how you say it. Boyana is a river in my country and a mountain. It's a famous one. So that's how the name began, I believe. I think after that, somebody named their daughter that, and it's only a female name, yes. Everything that ends with A in Serbian is a female name. Yes, I'm a Serbian born. I came to Australia when I was 10 years old. I wasn't very good at school, but I learned English through high school, and I was very insecure in my language, but oh well, I learned it. And um, what do I do with myself? <laughs> Well, I'm studying a recovery storytelling course and I'm getting paid to do presentations around the community agencies and it's a scholarship so I didn't have to pay for it, so I like it. Um, I do a lot, few art classes in a week and uh, you've seen my other video, I have a lot of art projects on my walls. And I go to the gym, I do the pools and fitness classes such as Zumba and um, yoga and water. I do use the pool. I do not like makeup, rare for YouTube, but I would put it on for a special occasion of where I really want to look nice, but I'm not really a makeup type of girl. My sister was a makeup artist, but I'm not a makeup type of girl, but I'm practicing because I always like to learn new skills and I can always look better and yeah, I like a bit of lipstick, but don't know how to use mascara, I don't know how to use eyeshadow, la la la, and then I came on YouTube to learn and I got addicted to it and guess what, now I'm, uh, I'm becoming a YouTuber myself. <laughs> I think that is pretty cool. I'm 32 years old, I'm turning 33, and I'm planning on having my party at a 
bowling club. I like playing outdoor balls, lawn bowling, and I like indoor balls too. I'm a very active person. I go out a lot. I travel. I go site to tour, day tours around Perth, and I post videos when when I go to exciting places. And I'm still using my iPhone because I'm very new to YouTube. I haven't got camera yet, but that's okay. I, there's time for that because the channel is not very big yet, so there was no need for it. And. What else is there about me to know? To know. I like to get my nails done. This girl that is yellow, I have never had yellow nails done. I get them done in every three weeks as a self care activity. And I got this butterfly ring as my present. I wear a Fitbit, measures my steps. They say that every day we should get about seven or eight hundred steps in a day. It happens on most days, but let's put it this way: we're not all greatly motivated to do uh, to do exercise and walking every day. And sometimes we have sitting down jobs to do. I might be working in an office soon, answering the phone for an insurance company. How am I supposed to get seven thousand steps in a day? I do go for a walk around the block twice a day. And then um, I'll have to do my exercises when when I am I'm not walking very much because I don't want my fitness level to go down. But I'm becoming kind of an addict to Fitbit. I like it. It uh, tells me how many steps I do. It tells me if I do stairs, but sometimes it miscalculates stairs and it tells me... Oh, you, congratulations, you have done stairs. And guess what? I actually haven't done stairs. And it tells me my heart rate, but sometimes I reckon it's talking crap because I don't have that much of a changes in my heart rate. <laughs> and it also shows how much we should be walking and how much it motivates us to walk more because we want to reach our goal. But we don't have to do it every single day. It's okay. Sometimes you, we're allowed to have a lazy day and just say, I walked yesterday a lot. I don't have to do it every single day. You know what I mean? And what do I do during my spare time other than walking <laughs> and the gym? I already mentioned my gym. Here we go. And... Zumba and yoga and the pool. What else do I do? I go out with my boyfriend Steven, who follows my channel, and I go out with my friend Jody and Amanda and some of my other friends. We go to the movies or whatever. I have seen so many movies lately. I can almost be a movie reviewer. Uh, it is funny when I join YouTube, I feel like I'm talking to myself. And that my neighbors think that I'm crazy. No one is in her apartment while she's talking. She can't talk that fast on my mobile phone having a conversation with someone. I feel like I want to make sure that they don't hear me. <laughs> because it makes me feel crazy when I just talk to the phone and go, My day was great today. I did art. I did art today and I drew a girl who has a whole story behind her but I will show you the story in my next video and every art has a bit of a story even if it's a very plain picture I never mock down anything like some people do because I think it always has a story because everyone is inspired by something to do a picture so it came from somewhere I will say I will leave you for now and hopefully YouTube will give me something more to do till I start working in the office job and I like watching everyone else's videos they're totally cool and yeah ciao Bella for now Woohoo!